As we pursue success for every student, it's critical to have strong leaders who shape the culture of our school communities. I'm always encouraged by the chance to visit schools across Knox County and see how principals and assistant principals are doing this work every day. This week, I visited Powell Middle School, where first year principal Denise Watts and her team have summed up their mission in a simple phrase, every door, great opportunities. As a principal and a mom, Ms. Watts knows how important it is for every student to receive excellent instruction and strong support no matter what grade they're in or what teacher they're learning from. That starts with relationships and making sure that students and staff know they are seen and heard. But it also involves intentional choices about curriculum and instruction that can be a big difference for learning. Powell is committed to using high quality instructional materials, providing the school's talented educators with curricular tools that foster deep learning. Ms. Watts has also made safety a top priority. At the beginning of the school year, her team met with the security division to create a clear roadmap for the year ahead and ensure a seamless partnership. That proactive approach is a good example of our district's Safe Schools, Safe Students initiative, which aims to provide a secure learning environment on each of our campuses. A key component of this effort is providing a highly trained armed school security officer in every school. With that in mind, I'm also pleased to attend the graduation ceremony for our newest SSOs this week. Each of these individuals has participated in our security department's intensive two-month training academy, and they are focused every day on protecting our students, staff, and schools. I'm grateful to Chief Jason Perriard and his team for their work to prepare and equip these new officers, and for each of these SSOs who has made the choice to serve our schools and communities. Thank you to Powell Middle School for hosting this week's video, and as always, thank you for supporting Knox County Schools.